You may sit. You may I believe sit. Lord Ethan has reached his decision. Before I name my sentinel, I must tell you. Duncan, Royland, this house needs you both. But you can only choose one, my lord. Let him be on with it. Many thought either of you would make a fine sentinel, but I have made my decision. You! No. No, I think. No, maybe I... I did promise it to you earlier. Accidentally. It, your relationship with him is already fucked. Sorry about that. You need to keep this dude in your pocket. Uh, yeah. Sir Royland de Gore, you will be my sentinel. God be praised. You've done well, Lord Ethan. You won't regret this. A poor choice, my lord. Forgive me for saying so, but it's true. Bound to piss you make a you. fool of me, my lord. You as much as promised it to me earlier. Yeah, that was a mistake. That's quite enough. I was just pushing buttons. The matter buttons. is settled. Now, Sentinel, what do you have to report of Ramsey Snow? My scouts say he's a day's ride away. We've no time to waste. He'll arrive before any of our allies could be here. Who knows what he's capable of? We need to prepare for the worst. We can devise a plan to deal with him. The Boltons need our people to harvest the ironwood. Even the bastard Ramsay must understand that. He's not coming here to negotiate. We must answer with the sword. That's bloody suicide. You gamble with the lives of everyone within these walls. Wrong. Quiet, Tuttle. You're not the Sentinel. I knew this would happen. He cannot be trusted. This is the small council, is it not? Enough! Would my father have stood for this kind of bickering? Neither will I. The Bolton sigil is a flayed man. Force is the only thing they understand. Put every man who can hold a spear or crossbow on the wall. And make the bastard fill his boots with piss. He would see it for the empty gesture that it is. And have us flayed. We must take a measured approach, my lord. Gentlemen, please. Thank the gods Mira has asked Lady Marjorie for her help. It's not too late for the Crown to intervene on our behalf, but we must have a plan if Mira's efforts are not successful. I trust Mira's judgment. I don't doubt she did everything within her power to help us. We all must agree on the plan. We cannot oh, leave until we have a consensus. Suggested. I, it didn't occur to me to. Ask Why not to make an offering for peace, my lord? Yeah, the wisdom yeah. of the citadel. We can give the Boltons ironwood in exchange for their protection. I think that's you must ball. be mad. It's pure folly to just give away the only currency we have to bargain with. Enough. We will. Although Sir Ryland may object, diplomacy, though. I shall use diplomacy with Lord Snow. I would be foolish to pick a fight without negotiating first. I'll offer our allegiance and try to reach a reasonable agreement. If you aren't ready for a fight, you're bound to lose when one breaks out. They need any excuse. Ethan has made his opinion known, and you will respect his decision. Here's a daughter. Respect my authority! We are, of course, here to serve you, as we served your father. Aye. Well then, let's decide how we shall set the stage for Ramsay's arrival. Invite him into this hall, and meet him face to face, lord to lord. Ramsay Snow is no lord. That's absurd. You meet him at the gate with as much force as we can muster. Make him wait. Let him gaze upon Ironrath. And when he enters, he'll know it's only because you allowed it. Lord Ethan? I'm not sure how strong we are. I don't think fucking with Ramsay is the right I think it move. Might, yeah. I will meet him in the Great him. Hall. It's careless. Can't you see Tuttle is steering you wrong? You will lead us into ruin! I've faithfully served this house for far you too you long to sit to here and listen closer. to this. Fuck off. You're likely to get us all killed. Sit down at once. Well, fine. Remember Apologies, that. my son. 
didn't throw him but out. Now that it is settled, we know what we must do. You will meet Ramsay Snow in the Great Hall, and we will not offer our ironwood. No matter yeah. what, I will stand beside you, my lord, where your sentinel belongs. See? Good. Then perhaps we should adjourn. We have to prepare the house. House of Pain is in effect, y'all. My lord, you have named your sentinel, but you still seem conflicted. And no matter what, you can't be indecisive. Not if you want to help this house. I made you... it's... Forgive me. I totally made decisions! There will always be those who question your leadership. Yeah. Which is why you need allies you can rely on. Family. Mira has done everything she can in King's Landing, but there are others who can help us. What about your brother, Asher? Malcolm told me. You want to bring him back. He's a skilled fighter. But what's more, he has the will to yeah, fight. Yeah, we'll see him. A hunger for it. He always protected you and your sister. Why would you bring him back after you exiled him? He exiled himself. He has no desire to rule. Asher is volatile. But that is his strength, too. Do you remember the Miller's boy? How he tormented you? I wanted to intervene, but your father said Ethan must fight his own battles. But when Asher saw it, he didn't take a breath. He grabbed the Miller's boy by the neck. That was his first instinct. Asher knocked out half the poor boy's teeth. Of course, your father was furious. But you were in danger, and there was nothing else Asher needed to know. Asher does not hesitate. He acts. Does and we hesitate. need that. You have many something. fine qualities. But you do not have that anger inside you. It's something we could use. Asher is dangerous and unpredictable. His presence could help or hurt. Having another sword at your side always helps. Especially now. I'm trying to do what's best for this family. What this family needs. Ethan, let me send Malcolm to Essos. Wait, who's Malcolm? Her brother. But then you get Asher back, so... To go get Asher. Yeah. Fine. Malcolm will go to Essos and bring Asher back. If you don't, then okay, he doesn't show mom. up. Hey, Mom. Thank you, Ethan. I'm glad you will let me do this. Know that you never stand alone. You are a forester. Mira stands with us, and she may be able to help us yet. Suffering. Hold L2, it shows. I know. No, no. Oh, what? L2. Sorry, I don't know. Oh. It shows the selectables. <laughs> Squint. So I can either use it or just stare at it. That's great. Take it. Fuck yeah. I took your shit. What are you gonna do? What's this? Key. I'm just gonna glare at it again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why bother what, looking at it before that, picking that's it up? Very, very funny. I'm taking Take all your it. shit. I'm taking all your shit. Take and the they're gonna shit. come in and like ask you if you took it. I bet you did. Yeah. Marjorie. Marjorie? <gasps> Oh, sorry. Oh. I took all your shit. Bitch. Lady what? Marjorie is still with the king. I thought you might want to, to know. You. Oh. Thank, Thank you. I thought we were friends, Mira. When you dismissed me the other day, I won't say it didn't hurt my feelings. We've known each other for years. 
We are friends, Sarah. Truly. Friends trust one another. They don't hold secrets. Now Lady Marjorie thinks you don't trust me. And she values your opinion very much. Sarah, I... Oh. And now Marjorie's bummed. Things are sucky, but I have a backless dress. My lady, I'll leave you to talk. Oh. Are you all right, my lady? The king was not inclined to offer help for your family. Uh, I'll need this mended. Gods. Oh, shit. What? He said I was too easily swayed. And he reminded me that I am not yet his wife. Oh, I allayed his fear. For now. But it will be a long time before I can ask him for anything again. He might tear my dress. Nothing I said could cheer him. He wouldn't even speak to me when I left him. What can I do to make this better, my lady? There's nothing you can do, Mira. Understand, it was my mother's plan, not mine. I just hope you can find some way to forgive me. This is simply not how things are done, Mira. Not in King's Landing. I'm sorry, I my lady. I got another chick abused by her psycho fiancé. <sighs> Soon this I will be happening. queen. And maybe then I'll be in a better position to help you. But for now, now, we must both be cautious. I must send a raven. I have to warn my family. If you'll excuse me, my lady. Plot failed. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. There's very little chance that would succeed. Yes. Milady. Begging your oh, pardon, boy. Milady. I hope I didn't frighten you. I'm glad to see you. Thank you, Milady. I hope you saw. I was right before. About Lady Marjorie and Queen Cersei. I just want you to know. I, I can help you if you'd like. And your family, if you're willing to trust me, I hear all sorts of things. Things that could be useful for you. How can you help me? My problems can't be solved by what you might overhear. Which is why you must trust me, milady. You need allies. Hopefully I've proven I could be useful to you. No, you haven't. I'm sorry. I... Yeah. I really must go. I, I Please don't do despair. I know people who... People who'd be willing to help you. Mm. Oh, armor. Where the bloody hell is Duncan? He should be here. Where is he? Fuck, now fuck him if he's angry. We'll do without him. And without King's Landing. I know you'd hoped Mira could help us, but I'm confident we've enough strength of our own. Oh boy, here we go. Your men are ready to act if needed. Our plan is a good one. It will work so long as everyone does their part. Isn't this a lovely pile of timber? <laughs> it's fucking good. Not the place I'd want to be if there was a fire. <laughs> Ironwood is near impervious to flame, my lord. Is it? <laughs> May I introduce Lord Ramsay of House Bolton? Son of Roos Bolton. Although a bastard, Lord Ramsay has the full authority of the Thank Warden you, of the... That's enough. Lud. Who is this little boy? Is he lost? Lord Ramsay, welcome to Ironrath. Aren't you the little lord? The Lord Whitehall told me you were young. <laughs> this! Look at you! 
Don't be a bitch. A token for the new Warden of the North. Let me guess. Forrester Iron. Carved by our most skilled craftsmen. Ironwood. Doesn't look like much. Don't know what's so special about it. What do you think? <laughs> Not bad. Lord Whitehill, can your lot do this? Given enough time, we could learn. Given enough time, you could do a great many things. But not this, apparently. Look at that. More Forrester. Lord Ramsay? <laughs> Come out where I can see you. Leave his penis alone. Force him to focus on the business at hand. Lord Ramsay, I understand you've come here for assurance of our fealty. Fuck fealty. We came here for justice. We'll get to your justice. Yeah. First, let's see you bend the knee to my father. Lord Bolton, Warden of the North. Words are wind. Anyone can say they're loyal. My lord. Ha! That wasn't so hard now, was it? Here's the thing. I don't care about your loyalty. The Crown, however, wants what you've got. Whatever you've been supplying the Starks for centuries later. Ships, shields, chamber pots. I expect you'll do the same for us. My father has promised as much to the King. You wouldn't want to make him a liar, would you? That wouldn't reflect well on me. You needn't worry. Your father will have what he needs. That's a good little lord. You can't trust her, Forrester. Oh, shit, fuck off. They murdered our men. It was her Forrester squire who did it. One Whitehill soldier dead. One Bolton. Yet your man lived. No, you're mistaken. That's not how it happened. Our men are dead. How it happened is irrelevant. Then you welcomed me into your hall like a proper lord, hoping I wouldn't linger outside long enough to notice your pathetic little army. That sort of insolence from one of our loyal bannermen will not do. So I've come up with a solution that will benefit everyone. The White Hills will be taking control of your Ironwood no. from this day Fuck off, never. What? what? No. The Ironwood? But... The White Hills are nothing more than up job My thieves! My word! You can't do that! <laughs> Why not? You know something the White Hills don't? We are talking about trees. You grow them, you cut them down. The White Hills had Ironwood, once, but now those hills are bare. True. Hence the name. Of course. They know nothing of how to cultivate oh, the forest. Mm -hmm. Look at their sigil, my lord. A barren hill. <laughs> Do you want ironwood for the next five years? Or the next fifty generations? The little lord does have a point. We'll try this. Lord Whitehill will take half no. of your ironwood. Um, no. And we'll see who fares better. But my lord... Half of something is Fucking better... Eye than the nothing you had before. To ensure there's no trouble, Lord Whitehill will no. install a garrison of no. no. 20 men within your walls. At Ironrath, no. that we cannot abide. No. Ethan. They'll help maintain the King's peace and make sure there's no more trouble. This will cause more trouble, not less. <laughs> not for me. Shit. You have a man you trust? My son, Griff. Griff <laughs> will lead the garrison. The seven hells he will. That's... Do make this visit worthwhile. Please, Sir Royland, don't. Look at this little forester. You're not frightened, are you? 
Lord Ramsay, please. And you? Are you Lord Ethan's older sister? I'm his twin, my lord. Ah, twin. Well, like the Queen and her brother. Well, <laughs> hopefully not just like the Queen and her brother. I never had a sister. Always wanted one. We have more to discuss, Lord Snow. I have an idea. You'll come with me. You can be my highborn ward. Lord <gasps> Ramsay, that's enough. Do you like Henry? Let her go. She's quite pretty, your sister. We get along well. I suppose you can stay. Aren't you the bold lord? Oh, no! What? what have you done? No! But I don't want a bold lord. Did I just get myself killed? Far too much trouble. Even though you did ban for me. Fuck you! I think we've come to an understanding. Holy shit! Oh my I God. certainly feel better about all this. They just came and thrown us. However, the foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. Fucking Ramsey. Stop! Take the boy as your wolf. No. Kill him if they give you any trouble. Right. Lovely meeting all of you. We'll have to do it again sometime. Somebody help him. Fetch the mixer quickly! You brought this on yourself. Mama! Be you. Stop! Don't let him take me! Oh. You will not take Stop him! Help me! Oh. Please, please. <laughs> no! Do something! Ethan? Oh. My son. God damn. <laughs> Holy shit. I think I made the right choices. I think you did too. I guess I was gonna die no matter what. Next, next time on Game of Thrones. Shit. That was brief. <laughs> you got Jon Snow. Ethan sacrificed himself for us all. He saved done. Talia's life. He'll be Roy. remembered as Ethan the Brave. This house leads a leader. Lord Ethan named me Sentinel. I will lead this yeah, house. Good. My sister asked you to swear loyalty to her son, and you did it without flinching. We can't let them hurt Ryan too. We have to stop them. We do not stand alone. There are those who will fight for us. Those who hold House Forrester above all other loyalties. There is. Those who will not stop until Ethan is avenged. Until Ryan is home again, our house will not fall. We will be ready. Nothing comes without a cost, my lady. Are you prepared for what might happen? 